All right, Shalom, Shalom. The real Hebrew Israelites coming day in and day out to prophesy the downfall of Babylon, the great, which is America. First off, foremost, our praises, honor, glory, be unto Yahweh, by Shem Yahweh Shai, by Shem Makarkadash. Double honor to thee, all the pops of the great millstone, thy patience to the elect, brother. Brother Shapaya coming at you again for another quick lesson in transit. Uh, the spirit of probably how about Shimmy Uh Today's lesson is about, you know, the Ovid uh, 19. Ovid, you know, you got to omit that see this thing, <laughs> you know, this invisible creature uh, that's out here. In this report I got from RT News, I actually got two of them. It said Saxony Migrant Center to be turned into COVID-19 jail for repeat quarantine violators. Right? A building that's used to host people seeking asylum in Germany is being converted into a Corona, uh, a, a Corona jail. All right? A uh, detention facility for people who repeatedly violate quarantine, the German tabloid line reported. I don't know how true this is, but uh, we're men of the Lord. We know they have things like this in place, i.e. concentration camps, because all this is, this is nothing but the prelude for the chip, all right? So there, there are certain, uh, it's called gradualism, man, all right? If they're getting you people uh, 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 comfortable uh, uh, for the situation that's coming up. It says the facility is located in the northern part of uh, Dresden, Saxony, and was built in 2017 at the cost of 30 million euros, which euros are more than uh, American dollars, which puts this at 36.4 million, to host, all right, people wanting, uh, waiting for their attention for asylum in Germany to be processed. Now the state authorities are what? They're converting it into detention centers meant to repeat quarantine violators, according to the newspaper. A person not isolating voluntarily will be ordered, or will be will be ordered to, when ordered to, will be given a warning, then a fine. If that doesn't work, the court may take their freedom. Officials explain, adding the measures meant to protect third parties from the unruly behavior of persons being accommodated at the facility. The site has a fence barbed wire on on top, judging by the uh, photo published by Bill, Bill and is to have uh, um, police guards. All right? So you can read the rest of this. All right? And uh, they're getting ready, man. All right, because it's people who don't want to take this vaccination, all right, is going to be looked at with scrutiny. All right, ostracized, uh, 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 things uh, uh, of that nature, man. All right, pretty sure. Uh, I mean, pretty soon, everybody who's against this so-called vaccination is going to be an enemy, which really is going to turn into the RFID chip. And if you don't take that, hey, you can't buy or sell. You're going to be an enemy, man. I e a. What Revelation says? Some of you should be thrown into prison. Prison. Okay. Now check this this next report out. All right. All right, it says French privacy watchdog slams authority for using drones to enforce COVID, I mean, COVID-19 rules and curfews. So all this goes hand in hand, man. And if you think they're not going to do this in America, you're out your mind. And years ago, you guys, you know, swore up and down that the things that was going on in Europe as, as far as the civil unrest was going to come here. Well, now it's here. It says French officials cannot use drones to make sure citizens, citizens are following curfew. Uh, staying apart and wearing masks, the nation's privacy watchdog has said. It's, uh, it's the third such dressing down. Like it. It's the third such, such dressing down for the police in eight, eight months. On Thursday, the Commission Nationale 
my information, uh, informational physique, information physique, something like that. And liberty, C R was that C L? I mean C N I L. The agency responsible for personal data protection regarding personal liberties slammed French Ministry uh, of the in, uh, Interior for using drone technology to record protests and monitor uh, uh, OVID-19 rule breakers. So with all this shit going on in America, do you think they're not going to do it? Use drones, hey, trying to protect the Capitol House, or when these riots and protests go on, hey, you're, you're violating uh, OVID-19 rules, all right? And you tie that into the detention centers, all right? They're going to have the picture of your face. That's why you got all these uh, facial recognition uh, cameras. And drones have that. They have that technology. So they'll, they'll, hey, they'll see you. They may not capture you that day, but they're going to show up at your houses, man. And they caught all, most of all the niggas they caught on camera uh, at, at Capitol Hill. FBI came and picked them up. So Esau has this technology to search you out and find you. So how much more when uh, things are getting more intense, um, when things are getting more bad, when they when they keep on stressing uh, this COVID nineteen, and you, now you got two to three different new strains that are deadlier than the original. All right, they're, they're going to try to pull some. All right, but uh, us brothers, hey, what, what the scriptures say? We are not ignorant of Satan's devices, man. All right, so we we, we know what he's getting ready to do. All right, the devil should come down uh, with great wrath uh, because what? His time is short, man. So he's going to show his horns, man. Okay? That's pretty much it. You you know, you brothers can um, look into these reports. All right? I'm going to say all praises, honor, and glory be unto Yahweh, by Shem, Yahweh Shai, by Shem, Kadash. Double honors to the old apostles of great meals, from the salutations to the elect, wherever you may be. Abide for all.